In our health alert tonight, a historic drop in cancer death rates. Yeah, that's according to the American Cancer Society, who says their latest study period marks the biggest single year drop ever. Our chief health editor, Dr. Partha Nandy, joins us now with the details. And Dr. Nandy, how much did the numbers drop by? So Heather, this is really good news because as a, as a physician, I see firsthand how devastating cancer can be. Now, this latest report shows that between 2016 and 2017, the U.S. saw a 2.2% drop in cancer deaths. Now, cancer death rates have been steadily dropping over the years since they peaked back in 1991. And since then, the rate has been falling by 29%. And that number translates to roughly 2.9 million fewer cancer deaths, which to me is simply amazing. But to see such a sharp decline in one year is really remarkable to me. Yeah, pretty remarkable, Doc. In fact, why has there been such a sharp decline that's driving these numbers down? So, Alan, a few things are contributing. The main one that we're seeing is a huge decline in lung cancer deaths. And that's likely because not only are fewer people smoking, but there have also been medical advances like improved surgical techniques, new immunotherapy treatment, and targeted therapies that fight cancer growth. Also, a type of deadly skin cancer has also seen a notable mortality rate drop, and that's melanoma, which, again, is likely the result of breakthrough treatments. But I also want to mention how early detection is really important important has contributed greatly because that's something anyone and everyone can take part in. It's important that you see your doctor regularly and get appropriate screenings and tests done because typically if a cancer is found early, well, guess what? The chance of beating it or living longer rises dramatically. So can we expect the cancer death rates to continue to fall? That's a great question, Heather, and I'd say, I'd love to say yes, but unfortunately our society is getting heavier in terms of weight and obesity could undermine the, the progress that's been made. In fact, 20% of all cancers have been linked to too much body fat. And so while it's great that cancer numbers in the decline, it's still really critical that we take care of our health by eating healthy, getting enough exercise, not just saying that, well, the numbers are going down, I can do whatever you want. It's really up to us to make a difference. Yeah, for sure. Some great information, Doc. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you. And if you have a question or a health concern for the doctor, you can email him, Dr. Nandy, at askdrnandy.com, or be sure to send it to us on Facebook or Twitter.